Guys, Jed Walters here in the next of the How to Play series. I'm going to talk a little bit about what's happening with the driver, especially into the wind. So how do we really want to play this tee shot with the driver into the wind? I see too many people teeing the ball down too much. And teeing it down is only going to increase the spin, so it's going to affect the flight. The ball's going to spin up a little bit too much, and then it's going to get affected by the wind. I'm going to show you a little bit what I mean. I've just sprayed the club face with some dry shampoo and I'm going to tee the ball down so if we look there that ball is you know if we look at that it's quite some way below the level of the club face so I'm going to hit this tee shot and teeing it down this is what we'd normally see a little bit of into the wind teeing it down maybe even a fraction back in stance as well so the ball being played a little bit more in here almost wanting to hit down on it and keep it down as we go through and the reality is if we hit down on it too much we're just going to spin it too much it's going to go up in the air So if we look there, that ball's not stayed in the air a great deal because it's sort of bloomed a little bit, so it's come down really early. And then if we look at where my impact is on the face, teed it down, it is a little bit low and a little bit toe side because I've hit the ball a little bit earlier on my path there. Right, so let's now do it the right way. So the right way is to tee it normally, nice and high. We want to hit the ball in the right part of the club face to optimise the spin so that we get the best flight. It doesn't matter if it's windy into, across or down, we still need to make those things happen. So to get the best out of it into the wind, tee it up, tee it high just like you would normally. Play the ball normally from that inside of the lead foot. Take your setup and we're going to try and get the ball to be be swept upwards as we normally would so the flight is really good everyone's after that sort of rainbow flight so let's create it by having the right setup conditions just as we would do if it was downwind or even if it wasn't windy at all so the difference in that flight there is incredible that ball stayed in the air it's carried much much further and then when we have a little look at that impact position there we can see it's more central but it's much higher up the face that's going to optimize my ball flight that's going to give me more control over the spin so i can hit the ball further into the wind guys stop teeing it down stop hitting it downward and creating too much backspin tear up optimize your spin find the right part of the club face and you're going to hit the ball so much better into the wind get out of there and try it make sure you do it. don't go back into the old habits guys as always thanks for watching if you like the video please give it the thumbs up click that thumbs up button so we know that you're liking the content that's being produced share it around with your friends as well please post your comments in the box below the more information i can get from you the more i can help you with your golf as well any ideas for the how to play series shots that you want to find out about a little bit more again post them in the comments box below there subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so it's totally free just click the link in the bottom there there's loads of great content on there lots more as well to come and i look forward to seeing you again next time thanks for watching